Revit Architecture allows you to use keyboard shortcuts to access any tool accessible from the ribbon bar. You can also use it to access and turn on or off certain parts of the user interface such as the Properties Palette or Project Browser. We've been using these keyboard shortcuts throughout the course, although you may not have realized it. All the keyboard shortcuts are fully customizable to suit your preferences. Access the Keyboard Shortcuts Editor from the View Ribbon Bar Windows Panel from the User Interface drop-down menu. In the Keyboard Shortcuts dialog, you can search for a specific command, filter the commands based on their location, or filter those currently defined, open for assignment, or those reserved which cannot be modified. I will search for VIS and you will notice that some commands have more than one shortcut assigned. The Visibility and Graphics Overrides command has the letters VG and VV assigned. The basic rules for keyboard shortcuts are relatively straightforward. Keep a shortcut to a maximum of five unique alphanumeric keys. You can create sequences that use combinations of Control, Shift, and Alt with another key. You cannot assign reserved keys, which you can find from the filter menu choosing All Reserved. You are allowed to assign the same keyboard shortcut to multiple tools, which will result in a prompt at the status bar and a tooltip with instructions. For instance, if two commands are both assigned the letters RC, you can toggle between them with the up, down arrow keys on your keyboard. To assign new keys to a command, select the command, in this case the revision cloud, and press new keys, RC, in the highlighted area. Click assign to assign those keys to the current command. To remove the shortcut from a particular command, Select the shortcut from the Assignments window and click Remove. Click to clear the search results. The editor does not prevent you from entering duplicate shortcuts. Sometimes this is desired since a few commands appear in multiple paths. Note that the visibility settings appears in several contextual tabs and some have shortcuts enabled. To check for duplicates, click on the Shortcuts column header and scroll down to the shortcut we just entered. Since RC is already assigned to repeat the last command, we may wish to choose a different shortcut. The Import and Export buttons allow you to import from another system or version of Revit or store a copy of your keyboard shortcuts for later reuse. Click on the import button. You may import an XML file from another computer and you may also import a keyboard shortcut text file from the 2010 version which also used the ribbon interface. For all prior versions to 2010 before the introduction of the ribbon interface importing keyboard shortcut files is not supported. Click Cancel. Now click Export to store a backup copy of your keyboard shortcuts. Choose a location and click Save. Note that file location and double click on the XML file in Windows Explorer. If your workstation does not have the viewer or the file does not open in your browser window, you can right click on the XML file to open it in Notepad. Only those commands with keyboard shortcuts assigned are actually exported to this file.